and we'll be happy to answer any questions. Right now, however, we invite you to take a short walk with us to an area designed to present further details of the 2707 story. Welcome to the technical briefing area, where we offer you the story of the Boeing 2707 graphically and in as much detail as you wish. Logically, the first bay unfolds the basic rationale for the variable sweep wing of the Boeing supersonic transport, making it, in effect, three airplanes in one. With the wings swept back the full 72 degrees, we will cruise safely at 1,800 miles per hour. With the wing at 42 degrees, we will cruise efficiently at subsonic speed. These panels illustrate some aspects of the structural testing program we have conducted for the 2707, simulating flight conditions and environment on different types of structures. The load on the wing pivot bearing of the Boeing SST is carried by dual pads, either of which is fully capable of handling the entire load alone. As you go through the power plant area, you are told of Boeing's 10 years of development of an engine inlet for the supersonic transport and of Boeing's extensive noise research program. Fire detection systems in the 2707 are explained, diagrammed, and demonstrated. The thrust reverser interlock is demonstrated as a positive mechanical safety device. And the fuel tank placement is diagrammed and explained. Boeing specialists act as host for this technical briefing. Here you are in the design support area, which describes the free-flowing exchange of information between Boeing and the airline. This accessory drive system display depicts an example of this design support. Its development made use of the analysis of a great amount of information fed back to Boeing by the airline. The redundancy of the three separate flight control systems for the SST is diagrammed on this lighted panel. The supersonic airplane requires signals received by the master servos are transmitted mechanically to actuators located at the control. In the electrical and electronics display, you are told that the SST will use a greatly improved electrical generation system. A solid-state frequency converter has replaced complicated hydromechanical drive systems. Service accessibility and convenience will be greatly improved with single units or whole banks of components easily removed for service and replacement. The greater simplicity of the access to the rear of the racks is equally impressive. A view over the model airport reminds us that while this presentation reveals the story of the airplane of the future, it is a future not far distant in which the 2707 will share facilities at present-day airports with the rest of the Boeing family of jets. You move past the half-scale model of the Ray Dome and other displays depicting equipment which will be used to detect clear air turbulence. This visitor relinquishes the comfort and relaxation of the passenger accommodation display to inspect the model of the flight deck. The model with its articulating nose graphically illustrates the excellent takeoff and landing visibility available with the nose in its lowered position. As one aspect of Boeing's highly developed product support program, the 2707 story is told in film. Included are such titles as the SST Configuration Story, Design for Reliability, Wings on Tomorrow, Facilities for the SST Program, Quality Assurance for the 2707, and many more. The film library is but one aspect of Boeing's highly developed product support program. <laughs>